I have neuroendocrine cancer. It is a somewhat rare form of cancer. Really what I'm up against is the uh, possibility of stroke, and heart attack, and, and failure of kidneys and liver. They have this disease that they're dealing with, and they're completely committed to this method. They spend 30 days here. I mean, this is an air-conditioned hospital with you know nurses and a bunch of people walking by every second. You know. Parkinson's disease, you need pure determination. I worry mostly about Nicola. She has more of the physical issues. She can't move. I don't want to get off this. I want to get better. I don't want to have to have this anymore. If it happens to be in the job, I've got to find it. I was diagnosed about a year ago with pre-diabetes. I'm supposed to take insulin if my blood sugar go up too high. I've done so three times, and every time I get there, I have to go to the hospital. So I can't live this type of life with diabetes. I, I know there's an alternative. sure indigenous people have always known these plants are you would almost say sentient beings they've got a, a nervous system they've got a, an intelligence and the further we get away from them the more disconnected we become from ourselves and you know in these retreats it's, it's not only physical it's emotional it's spiritual mental I, I would prefer to go home because I'm, I'm not gonna, it's, this is not gonna work out for me every day I'm fighting to be a a trial. It's not easy. Just a wild roller coaster ride. This has been the most significant 30 days of my life. The issues that we have, they come from here. And here. And if you deal with it here, then the physical will go away. That's what they work with here. That's what's going on here.